The Gospel for Saturday of the 17th week in Ordinary Time is taken from Matthew, 14th chapter, 1st through the 12th verse. Herod the Tetrarch heard of the reputation of Jesus and said to his servants, This man is John the Baptist. He has been raised from the dead. That is why mighty powers are at work in him. Now Herod had arrested John, bound him, and put him in prison on account of Herodias, the wife of his brother Philip. For John had said to him, It is not lawful for you to have her. Although he wanted to kill him, he feared the people, for they regarded him as a prophet. But at a birthday celebration for Herod, the daughter of Herodias performed a dance before the guests and delighted Herod so much that he swore to give her whatever she might ask for. Prompted by her mother, she said, Give me here on a platter the head of John the Baptist. The king was distressed. But because of his oath and the guests who were present, he ordered that it be given, and he had John beheaded in prison. His head was brought in on a platter and given to the girl, who took it to her mother. His disciples came and took away the corpse, and buried him, and they went and told Jesus. The important thing about this story is the death of John the Baptist, and the reason it seems to me that it was important that he die before Jesus is that because he is the one who was destined to be the greatest of the Old Testament prophets because he points directly to the fullness of the Old Testament, the person of Jesus Christ. So it's just another reminder of how important it is that all the stories of the Old Testament are now fulfilled in the person of Jesus
closing prayer. Father, we know that you are the one who has come into the world in the form of a human being to save us. Help us to continue to focus on the Christ, the one who is the model for all that we must become. And we ask this in Jesus' name, amen.